Hey folks, how you doing? Well, something's been bugging me lately. Uh, basically, there have been very few people on YouTube who are ex-Muslims and almost no one, at least no one I can find, who is an ex-Muslim of the Nation of Islam. So, I'm in a bit of a quandary because I don't really want to be famous. Not that I can imagine I would be. But that's not my goal, and so I'm a little afraid to go out there and start leaving little messages on fellow ex-Muslims YouTube videos or giving super chats because they mention my name, my username. And if I say something wrong, then, oh my gosh, you know, how dare he say this, or if I give two dollars in the super chat to somebody who I think is cool and then they say oh my god I like Hitler oh no now the black apostates are Nazi it's all kinds of weirdness like that so I, I just want to make sure something's clear if there is a group of people you find to be quote-unquote problematic oh my god or not patriotic you know if you start to get afraid of that going on just just tell me directly okay you don't need to go and do a hashtag and go on Twitter and talk about how evil I am. You don't have to, you know, do some flame war with me. I, I have no desire for any of that. I want to give information. There aren't that many ex-Muslims who are proud and happy to come out and talk about this stuff. So I don't want to be an easy target to pick off because I only know about seven of them who have really decent content. I, there's introverted smiles and there's Vidu Vids, I think is his name, or Vinu Vids, Vidu Vids. Uh, there's uh, that uh, guy whose last name is Islam. I think he's from India. Like there's there's a, there are a couple. Uh, th there is a couple. Um, I don't know. I, do I really want to take a risk and have a bunch of folks on the left and the right and you know? I say something about women, and it's like, oh, no, he doesn't understand real problems about women. It, I just, no. I just want to talk about my understanding of Islam, what it's like to be an African American, what it's like to be a kid in this country growing up in this stuff, you know, all that kind of thing. I, I want to be that person. And I don't think I can do that unless I can open up and say it's okay to challenge my stuff to my face. With the, not that face, you know what I mean? You just come directly to me and tell me. And I'm fine with that. You're not going to make me angry. You're not going to make me sad. I'm not going to go emo on you and go run away. Just be honest. Be open. And it'll be, it'll be okay. All right? I guess that's it for now. Have a great St. Patrick's Day. See you guys later.